Hey guys, welcome to a new vlog. It is Friday and right now we're having a thunderstorm and it's actually a really good thunderstorm. Like it's been going on for about 30 to 40 minutes already with consistent thunder and lightning, which is my favorite. I'm so excited because we haven't had a thunderstorm like this in a long time. So this is my favorite weather. Sorry, I had to move because my arm was getting exhausted from holding up the camera. <laughs> um, so Andrew actually just went out to meet his friend Daniel for a bike ride and they were thinking that the weather was supposed to clear up around 6 and it's a little after 6 now so I'm not really sure if they're going to even be able to ride because I still hear some thunder and it is sprinkling out so... We'll see how their ride goes. If they are able to go, I'm gonna insert some footage because Andrew brought the GoPro. So this weekend is gonna be really chill. Um, tomorrow we're actually, we're not doing anything other than meeting our friend at a park. And I'm really excited because it's gonna be the first time that we're meeting his wife. Um, they've been reunited after being separated for a really long time. She is here in the States now. And yeah, tomorrow's gonna be our first time meeting her. So I'm very excited. We're going to this place called Tift Nature Preserve, which um, is a beautiful park within the city of Buffalo. So it kind of shows how you can have these beautiful natural places where wildlife can flourish within a city. So yeah, I really like it there. Andrew and I volunteered there for a while. It's just a really beautiful park. So if you live in the Western New York area or you're visiting, I highly recommend visiting Tift. Um, today, I'm just hanging out at home. I'm gonna work on Plume's website a bit and relax, maybe do some reading, watch a movie. Um, I wanna make like a welcome. Hi! Hi, hey, baby. I wanna make a little welcome package for my friend's wife, so I'm gonna work on that as well. But other than that, I'm not really doing anything, which is nice. Do you wanna say hi to your followers? Yeah, that's, I can't show them that. Hmm. Oh, sitting on my shoulder. Hi, baby. I've been feeling so small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm trying to work on my card, but I <laughs> my my reference is underneath Nunu at the moment. Sprinkles finally settled down. Oh, she's so cute. She was walking all over my stuff too. It is really hard to get anything done with these two girls. They're bad. Look at her. So rotten. Are you rotten? Yeah. You sit on my stuff. Yeah. Oh, so I just got back from my bike ride. It wasn't a long bike ride. We only went for like eight, a little over eight miles. Um, Pathetic. But I haven't gone in a couple of weeks. And we did it in Springville instead of at Sprague Brook, because when we got to Sprague Brook, it was raining. And I chose the route, and I should have known better, because I knew there was this enormous hill on Mill Street, and yeah, it, it about killed me. It was rough. But it was kind of a shorter ride, and the rest of the ride was really easy, especially compared to what we do in Sprague Brook. So it was nice. Um, definitely worked up a sweat, and my heart rate was racing, especially oh, no. going up that hill. Oh my god, that I have nightmares of the hill. when we 
the road past Nicole and Max's house. We're going up the hill, and there's a ginormous hill coming. It was treacherous. And there we go down the hill, and there was like three or four cars that passed us, and it, you couldn't even see if there were cars coming the other way. It was horrible. Oh yeah, and then here I'm going up this hill, and holy poop, Daniel just blows me out of the water. It was tough. It was a hard hill. I was whooped. And I'm kind of catching up, and then Daniel comes back, and then there he passes me again. And we're still going up the hill. I'm so slow at hills. And then we get to this intersection, and we were thinking about what to do. And we decided to just turn right. And just head back home. That's kind of the shorter route. This was actually quite an easy ride after we got done with that hill. Everything was pretty easy from there on. Yeah, we, we're, we're back workout. home now. Yeah, it was a good workout and uh, back home now, just hanging out. Sarah's making a card and yeah. No, it's kind of nice to have a relaxing, you, well, I mean, you weren't relaxing, you were biking, but. I mean, but it's not me. bad. The cats have been torturing me. They keep climbing on here, jumping They want to the help paint. you paint. <laughs> they want to help you paint your card with their paws. You should take their paw, no, 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 no. No, And honey. dip it in the paint and then put a paw print on the card. <laughs> That would be cute. That would be cute, but that's dangerous. They can't eat the paint. And then they get paint all over everything. Yeah. We don't need that. But yeah, we're just going to kind of relax. Oh, I'm so tired. I got to finish this card and then I'm going right. to chill. Goodbye for now. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning now. I kind of got exhausted last night and fell asleep and didn't film anything else. So that's why there's been an abrupt change. Um, I'm just getting ready now to go. We're going to stop at my sister's house before we meet our friends. And we're going to see her puppy. She has a baby Pomeranian. It's really cute. Her name is Sweet Pea. So we're going to stop there and hang out with the puppy for a little while. And go do some shopping in Buffalo and then meet up with our friend. Ugh, I'm putting on sunscreen right now and then I'm going to do my makeup. And then be ready to go. This is the extent of Andrew getting ready in the morning. He's putting on his sunscreen. Do you know how hard it was to convince him to put on sunscreen, sunscreen facial moisturizer in the morning? It was very difficult. Well, we've been together 11 years and this is the only thing I do for skincare. <laughs> so that's how long it took. I don't know, you've been doing it for... Oh, I've been doing it for a couple years maybe? Yeah. It's important but not very long. for your skin health. <laughs> I don't see any reasonable differences, <laughs> so I can't verify that that's true. Yeah, because you don't have sun damage on your face. I didn't have sun damage for 27 years. That's because you're so young. Oh, interesting. It's so hard though. It's this hard is to Andrew's remember. morning routine. Face lotion and deodorant. <laughs> gotta try to smell not terrible. It's so funny because you look so different without your glasses on right now. I know. The camera doesn't show the large indents. Oh, there you go. He has <clears throat> um, <clears throat> black and blue marks all around his eyes and indents right there from wearing glasses every day. They're so heavy. They are heavy, yeah. My nose Permanently is damaged. very strong from holding up the heavy glasses. Yeah. Your, your little mustache thing is white from the sunscreen. Oh, yeah, I've got to shave it off, actually, because <laughs> it's, like, getting longer. Aw. Mm -hmm. All right, should we go? Yeah, let's do it. So we made it to Buffalo, and now we're just looking... Ooh, 
I don't know, something's in our car. The windshield oh, washer fluid. Windshield washer fluid. fluid in the back of the car is moving around. But we made it to Buffalo. I was charging my camera on the way here, so that's why I didn't film anything. But Broken we're about to go see. Everywhere. Oh no. We could go see Sweet Pea. I'm so excited. It'll be our second time seeing her. She's so cute. Yeah, she's a little puppy. Mm -hmm. That's what they look she's like so when they're tiny. puppies. We watched that show, remember? It said that's the way the animals are when they're babies. They're really yeah. cute and it triggers us to want to care Paternal for them. Paternal instincts. Well, I don't know about that. <laughs> but let's, let's do it. Oh, thank you for the kisses. I appreciate that. Hi, sweet pea. Oh, hi. Well, what are you doing? I've been in Buffalo the whole afternoon because we decided to postpone our walk because it was so hot and it's still hot. It's, it's just extremely hot today. Over 90 degrees today and really humid. And it's we're just still not. 90 out right yeah, now. it's still 90 <laughs> out. We're on our way to Tift um, now. It might not be too bad, like, because it's all shaded, you know, it's all in the woods. Yeah. So I don't know. It'll be shaded and we're kind of going to be closer to the water, so hopefully it'll be a bit cooler. But. Yeah, we've been hanging out in Buffalo all day with my sister. Um, Her boyfriend. Yeah, and Daniel, so that's been fun. And yeah, it's almost 6 o'clock now, so we're heading to TIFF. Gonna meet Nima in Raiwan, and yeah, excited. Watch us. Talking trash behind your back, right, Juan? All of the trash. The trash.
I'm scared for my life. A race car on a racetrack. Mm -hmm. The sky's beautiful. We're on our way home. It is 8.30. We had so ramble. much. Andrew is just really into the race car thing right now. <laughs> We're gonna ram them. We're playing bumper cars. Sorry, you guys couldn't even see anything. Um, That's very dangerous times. <laughs> very dangerous. We had so much fun meeting um, Ema and hanging out with Red One. Yeah. It was so cool. It was cool. good to catch up. It's been on so long. Yeah, we haven't seen Red One in a long time. Got it. Has it been since really? the wedding? No, we saw him since the wedding. Did we? Yeah, we went to Five Points. Okay. But barely, like we haven't seen I know, him. We just haven't seen him. I yeah. think he's been really busy. And yeah. We've been busy. And, and it was really nice to meet Eva, and she made us yeah. this delicious custard. So it's like a custard with chopped up apples and pomegranate arrows and watermelon bananas. and grapes and bananas. Like it was really, really good. Yeah. Um, yeah, she's really sweet. I didn't film a lot because that would be weird. Um, so yeah, so now we're on our way home and it's kind of late. I'm just gonna relax. Yeah. There's a YouTuber I want to watch. She just put out a video. And Andrew, I'm sure, is gonna play with Daniel. Yeah, maybe. And there's a show that we discovered. I think it's called The Secret World of Pets. It is like a docu-series on Netflix. And it sounds like David Attenborough is the guy um, narrating. narrating, but I'm not 100% sure. But it is a super interesting and cool show. Highly recommend it. So maybe I'll watch an episode of that tonight as well. It's very cool if you're interested in animal lives at all. Oh, which you should be. It is really it's interesting. Awesome. Just how intelligent they are. Yeah, there's so much we don't know about other animals. It's very interesting to learn, like, just assumptions that people have and how they're wrong. <laughs> well, it's just because of how we're educated, you know, we're not taught that. So people think yeah. less of non-human animals. But they're so smart. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's gonna storm. Yeah. It's really cool looking, actually, the clouds. I'll show you the clouds. I wonder if you're gonna be able to tell. Uh, it's it's not as dark. It's and, not as vibrant. And on the camera as it is in real life. 